Well, Kobe, looks like... Well, Kobe, looks like it's just you and me for the week. Jennifer's off on some field trip to Israel to some art gallery, so we won't be seeing her for a while. Isn't it exciting? Oh no! I'm stuck with Miss Bubblegum instead of Miss Bubblemouth. This will be a long couple weeks. You know, Kobe, I should teach you how to do art. And now I don't think I will survive these couple of weeks now. Goodbye, big world where there isn't enough cheese. Rainbow, where in the world is my level? Um, did I say come in? No, I just let myself in. Well, here begins the chaos. Pony Boy having a meltdown is my cue to have a lounge down. A lounge down away from here. Sorry for borrowing it for so long, Max. It's just, I was trying to channel my inner brush stroke by making it as straight as possible on tinfoil. Sounds like you got experimental with a level. Well, yeah, yeah, actually, I did. <laughs> Abstraction is so stupid. Then why are you in art school? I'm aiming for design. Ah, oh, cool. Very technical. Wait a minute. The door's open. Where's Kobe? Kobe? Max, Kobe's not in the room. to our story Where's the paint tray to our some sort. It's like a doctor's office in here, without the fish tank. Oh no, there's a big man and big boy! Jake, I can't believe you let that coffee pot explode! Sorry, Principal Willie, but it wasn't my fault. This thing was just too old, and it was too used. Just deal with it, okay? I can't deal with it, okay? That coffee pot was paid for with a lot of money from my son Kyle, except he's not here right now. Big man ain't easy. Oh no, he's coming this way. Time for me to run. Oh man, where am I now? Am I lost? I'm so cold. Dear Lord, is there a light with any cheese? Or any light? But preferably cheese over light. Oh hey, there's a shed! Guess there is a light after all. Now let me hope this light has some cheese. Get that! My office and my desk are all clear. Now I have room for a Peruna fish or a goldfish. I don't know which it is. Hi, Violetta. Hey, let's move all this crap out of here and around. Hey kids, hey, what are you doing? Why are you messing with my goddamn stuff? Sorry, we're just here for help. You need some help. That's what you both need. Maybe you're the one who needs the help, miss? Get out of here! Both of you, now! Well, looks like nothing's here, Max. Okay, let's go, Rainbow. Man, it's like they took the guidance counselor chair and turned me into the student who needs help. Hey, both of you, get back here and clean up this mess. By the way, those papers you dumped on the floor were my last signed copies. George Michael's posters 
from his concert in 1991 from the Cover to Cover Tour. It's a rarity! Hello, students. Everybody. Faculty I only tolerate. This is your principal, Principal Willie, with yet again some morning boring announcements. First off, I'd like to say hats off to Ms. V for having photos signed by George Michael from his 1991 concert cover to cover tour. Not everyone has those. It's like having a photo with President Richard Nixon or with Roy Orbison or with Weird Paul. But congratulations, Ms. Violetta Goldberg, on your treasure. Secondly, I'd also like to give you some bad news. Those photos were thrown on the floor recklessly by artists who are reckless. Rainbow Elamino and Max Diamond. You are both intolerant, and I will find you to tell you to clean that mess you made in Ms. V's office up. Third and finally, it is rodent season. So if you see any loose rodents, such as rats or mice, get your mouse traps or get your guns and shoot them. Thank you, everybody. Once again, this has been the morning and boring morning announcements. A mouse got to get out of the house. Mouse got to get out of that house. Well, hello. Hello, sweetie pie. Beauty pie. what you may think, but because I am on a wet floor of melting ice. Well, my owner has a house in Atlanta. It's a two-story. Two stories usually can fit a fridge in it. Most likely, she ain't lactose intolerant. Okay, sounds good hot stuff. By the way, What's your name? Mine's Kobe. I like the way you talk, gorgeous. Okay, here's the final piece. Move, everybody! Hey, you're not Kyle. And now it's broken again. Are you serious? What is wrong with you both? We lost Kobe. Yeah, a rat that our friend had. He's a mouse. I prefer the term rat, and I'm not talking to Kobe. Well, there are no rats here. Maybe he's in Principal Willie's office? Hey, coffee substitute guy, can you diverge a distraction for us? Why should I? We'll buy you a new coffee pot for the shop. Okay, done and done. Let's go violate the big boy's workspace. Principal Willie, I need your help. Yeah, you need some. The coffee pot. I fixed it, and then it had coffee in it, and then it exploded again all over the kitchen, causing people uh, major burns and giving them eye infections. Oh no, my school's coffee kitchen. Jake, get the students out of there. They're going to make an even bigger mess. J just come with me and see. Come, come on. You know that I am worried more about the kitchen, right? It's made out of granite. All right, let's mess everything up and look for him. And I'm going to leave some traps. That will kill him, Max. That's kind of the point, and not just for the mouse. Well, those traps are useless anyway, because he's not here. Oh. Well, I hope Principal Willie had some fun. Let's go. Ugh, I can't believe we couldn't find that mouse. Looks like that mouse is out of the house. Oh, Jennifer left her phone here. Just answer it! Hello, this is Jennifer's roommate, Rainbow. Who is this? Uh, yeah, hi, this is David, Jennifer's brother, calling from Atlanta. Yeah, I think I found her mouse. 
Her mouse is currently at my place, trying to go at it with this other strange female mouse. Can you, like, help me out here? Oh my god. Max. Kobe. Is it Atlanta? Making a bunch of mouse babies. Well, that's typical Kobe for you.